You want to behold the glory of the Lord Jesus Christ in this life. Look at the person of the Lord Jesus Christ and look at his work. And looking at his person, the Lord Jesus Christ represents the invisible God. He is the express image of his person. 2 Corinthians chapter 4, verse 6. For it is the God who commanded light to shine out of darkness, who has shown in our hearts to give the light of the knowledge of the glory of God in the face of Jesus Christ. How do you seek his face? You go to his word. You go to his word, right? The word is the field in which you dig for the surpassing treasure, right? You're digging for the treasure in his word, that treasure that you would gladly give everything that you have to purchase the field and have the treasure. The word is the field in which you dig. Seek Christ, seek his glory in his word. Hebrews chapter one, verse three. Christ is the brightness of his glory and the express image of his person. Colossians chapter one, verse 15. He is the image of the invisible God. So in this life, we see his glory by faith in two ways. One, his person. Secondly, by his work. The Lord's perfect obedience. Perfect, sinless life. The Lord's perfect atoning work. His substitutionary atonement. Perfectly satisfying the wrath of God. Perfectly satisfying the just demands of God's law. His perfect work. His perfect sacrifice.